Tito the tree frog finds a beat in his heart that can't be ignored. Join him as he learns to play the conga drums and brings joy to his friends in the tropical forest. Will Tito's newfound passion help him overcome challenges and spread happiness? In the heart of a lush tropical forest lived a bright green Cuban tree frog named Tito. Tito had big, curious eyes, long, sticky toes, and always wore a tiny straw hat. He loved jumping from tree to tree and splashing in the cool, clear streams. One sunny morning, Tito heard a strange but exciting sound coming from deep in the forest. It was different from the chirping birds or the rustling leaves. It was a rhythmic, thumping beat. Intrigued, Tito followed the sound and soon found a pair of old conga drums sitting under a grand spreading tree. Tito's heart skipped a beat with excitement. As he tapped on the drums with his little froggy fingers, he felt a joyful rhythm bubbling inside of him. This is amazing, Tito thought, realizing he had found a new wonderful passion. Tito couldn't stop thinking about the conga drums. Every day he hopped back to the grand spreading tree to practice. Tap, 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 he played on the drums, feeling the rhythm echo through the forest. Soon his animal friends started to notice. Curious, a colorful parrot named Pico flew down to watch. Wow, Tito, you're really good, Pico squawked. Tito blushed and kept playing. Next, a friendly little monkey named Manny swung down from the trees. I love your music, Tito, Manny clapped. Tito beamed with joy. Day by day, more friends gathered to listen. There were squirrels, butterflies, even a shy deer came to enjoy Tito's conga beats. Tito felt so happy to share his music with everyone. But the more he played, the more Tito realized he wanted to learn even more about the conga drums. He knew he had to keep practicing and learning to get even better. One evening, as Tito was practicing on his conga drums, a sudden storm rolled in. The lightning flashed and thunder roared, scaring Tito and his friends. As the rain poured down, Tito's beloved drums got soaked and muddy. He tried to play, but the wet drums made a strange, sad sound. Disheartened, Tito feared he would never make beautiful music again. His friends huddled around him, offering their support. Don't give up, Tito, said Manny the monkey. We believe in you. Pico the parrot added. Tito nodded, but inside he felt so sad. He loved his drums so much, but now they seemed ruined. Tito decided to wait for the rain to stop, hoping to find a way to fix the drums. As the storm raged on, Tito dreamed of playing happy, bouncy tunes once more, not knowing if it would ever be possible. The next morning, the storm was gone, and the forest was fresh and green again. Tito hopped over to his conga drums, worried about their condition. But to his surprise, the sun had dried them out, and they looked almost new. Excited, Tito tapped on the drums, and a happy sound echoed through the forest. His friends gathered around, dancing and cheering. You did it, Tito, Pico squawked joyfully. Your drums are fine. Manny clapped his hands in delight. Tito grinned from ear to ear, feeling a surge of happiness. He realized that even when things looked bad, they could get better with time and patience. Filled with new energy, Tito played his conga drums with all his heart making everyone dance and laugh. He felt proud and grateful for his friends who had believed in him and never let him give up. Tito knew he could overcome anything with their support. From that day on, Tito's music filled the tropical forest with joy and laughter. Every evening, Tito and his friends would gather under the grand, spreading tree to enjoy the conga beats. Even animals from far away came to listen and dance. Tito felt proud of his music and the happiness it brought to everyone. He continued practicing and learning new rhythms, always grateful for the support of his friends. One day, Tito's friends surprised him with a big party to celebrate his amazing conga drumming. There were colorful flowers, tasty fruits, and joyful dancing. Thank you, Tito, for bringing us together with your music, said Manny, giving Tito a warm hug. Tito smiled, knowing that his passion for the conga drums had filled the forest with not just sound, but love and friendship. Tito knew that as long as he had his drums and his friends, he would always be happy. We hope you enjoyed this story. If you liked this video, please go ahead and push the like button. If you like the content and want to see more, please subscribe to our channel. Goodbye.